Hi, I'm Adrienne Wrights, the Marketing Communications Manager here at Cornell Cookson, and I'm here today to show you how to commission a 300 series door. When you first turn on your Apex Smart Controller, it will say Program Mode, press OK to start commissioning or making the door operational. So we'll press OK. We need to confirm that the door is more than two feet from the open and close limits. Now this door is, but if we needed to change it, you would go into this setting here. You'd open the box, and this little switch over here, you'd turn off. That puts your uh, Apex Smart Controller into override mode, and then all you'd need to do is open or close the door to get it to the desired height. When you're done with override mode, Simply switch back on and start again. So now we can press OK to start commissioning. We can now confirm the door is two, more than two feet from the open and closed limits. So it says if it's yes, then you hit OK for two seconds. So we're going to go one, two. Now it says press open and close to start the phase check. This is where you can make sure that up is up and down is down. Apex, the Apex Smart Controller can actually <clears throat> fix that. So if down is up and up is down, it can fix that electronically for you and you don't have to rewire anything. So we'll press open and close to start the phase check. That's also why you want it more than two feet away from any of the open or close limits, because it's gonna go up and down a little bit as it decides which way is up and down. Now that we're done phase checking, it says the auto phase check is complete and press OK. Next, you need to open the door to the desired uh, open limit. Now remember, we haven't hit set any stops, so you need to be very careful when you open the door so it doesn't hit the coil. So now we've reached our desired open height. It says open door to desired open limit. Click OK. Then the Apex Smart Controller will ask you, did the door reach the open limit? Press OK if yes. Then it says to press close to close the door at low photo eye. Now for this, you have to hold the close button down. That's where that bottom bar flag becomes really important because that bottom bar flag will then stop the door at that low photo eye. So we're gonna click close and keep pushing it until the door goes all the way down to the low photo eye. Now, even though I was pressing close, it did stop at that low photo eye. So yes, it did stop. Now it says jog to tune the close limit. So that just means push, it, push the close button a little bit more, being careful until you reach the desired uh, closing limit. You wanna make some contact there. When that's done, press okay. If the door reached the close limit, confirm OK. Now setup is complete and you're ready to operate your 300 series door. It says setup is complete with a code and then press OK. Then it says that you can fine tune in the menu, but we're ready, go, ready to go. Press OK again. And then you'll see it says standby and you're ready to operate. So that is how you commission in real time a 300 series door. We hope you find this helpful. Check out our other videos on how to install a 300 series door and also how to do some of the different adjustments. Thanks so much.